All right, what is going on, everyone? Thank you all so much for stopping by the Card Dojo. My name is Sean, and this is my journey into modern day card collecting. Well, guys, it's the weekend, it's Saturday, and we're gonna do a little updates, news, and mail as usual. Um, this week was uh, especially brutal at the Targ Marts. There were there were no sports cards whatsoever, guys. I couldn't find anything. I saw that there was a restock of 2019 products, oddly enough, and uh, I missed it. All that was in the shelves was like the empty sleeves for the advertisement, but you know, I don't like to walk out empty handed. So, um, yeah, I got this thing here. I got this Pokemon, uh, Eevee. And then additionally, I don't know if this will fit on camera. Let me hold it way back here. I got that thing. Uh, I don't know what it is. It's a big old box of uh, um, Eternus VMAX Premium Collection whole lot of stuff going on here. There's a token, a giant card, a couple packs, and then a, a little pin, which is not getting on camera. There you go. There's the little pin. All right, guys, so that's it. Literally, that's all I got was those two Pokemons. I went to the LCS that I visited a few weeks ago, and they told me they forgot to give me a baseball card for National Baseball Day. So I got this Alonzo for the New York Mets to add to uh, the collection. And that will about do it for updates, guys. Like I said, it was brutal. I can't be one of those guys waiting in line uh, all day long for cars because I have a job. So there's that. On to mail. This one, guys, comes from Derbs, Sports Talk, and Cards. So this is our buddy Nick over with um, the Fantasy Rip League. That's it in that envelope. A lovely color blue envelope. I like that. Um, and we have a little note. And we have two little team bags of cards. This was just a, uh, a care package, as they call it. Um, a little act of kindness from, from the Derbs. So let's see. Sean, a few cards to grow. A few cards to help the dojo grow. Love the content, buddy. Even the Pokemon. 1,000 subs is in your near future, Nick. Well, hopefully. We got a long way to go. But I appreciate the words of positivity. We got a couple things unpackaged. So first we have, everyone calls these one of one fillers, but now this is actually a one of one because we have a lovely um, note on it. And then it looks like he reused that because he had the Mariners in one Touchdown! hit. So the first card guys, Travis Kelsey, numbered 199, 181. And that is from Prestige 2020. Highlight real nice. Okay. Oh, guys, I had these baseball cards out just because I want to rip some baseball today. There's going to be a segue into that from our second package. All right, guys, we got a um, <clears throat> adrenaline line, adrenaline rush for Saquon Barkley. From the New York Giants out of Phoenix. This is nice. 2019. A product that I have not ripped. I have not found any 2019 Phoenix to rip. So that would be nice, but I just can't find it. All right. We got a Joe Montana as a chief, which I always enjoy picking up. Very nice. And hey, there you go. Miko Hardman Jr. with the Chiefs PC. Looks like, is this 2020 Donruss? It is. So, very recent products. Very nice. Always appreciate Miko Hardman. And who does not appreciate Joe Montana? Hey, look, he has an auto. Wow, dude. Not to do that. We got an auto for uh, DeAndre Baker, number 27 to 49. Um, is this the guy that got into a little trouble? I am not sure, and uh, Google and Alexa just don't help me. I don't think I want to go there today. But man, this is very nice. Contenders playoff. And it kind of looks like he signs it almost like dab or dub. Interesting. Very cool. I think this is one of my first giant um, autos. Here we go. Boom shakalaka! Jason Smith for the Knicks. Present potential. Totally certified too, guys. 14, 15. Very cool. This is my first basketball autograph. This is my, my nearest team now because the Nets moved away. To Brooklyn. I'm closer to Manhattan, so... I have that going for me. We got Mirror Red for Alfonso Soriano. Look at that. That's a cool looking patch. 
This is my first Yankees patch, my first PC piece of, oh, it's numbered um, in red, 111 out of 150, but this is my first Yankees mem card. It's got a cool little pinstripe right there, too. Very cool, very cool. Thank you, man. That is crazy. He's a Browns fan, guys, so anytime you want to have a, you have some Browns cards, ship them his way. He actually appreciates them. <laughs> All right, on to another filler card, which is fantastic. We're gonna throw it over there for the side. All right, Eli Manning, numbered uh, 128 out of 225, certified. Get a little Manning face. Always looking worried and concerned, but he got the job done, didn't he? The Iron Man of the Giants. Uh, we're gonna put him uh, right here. Hey, Patrick Mahomes. Epics. It's from Score. I think it's from Score 2019. Yes. All right. I don't think I had this one. That is fantastic. Thank you very much, dude. Hey, there we go. Another one. Score. Patrick Mahomes. Um, he they played against the Bengals. He got a million points. This is a red parallel. And as you know, I love red parallels for the Chiefs. I'm just gonna keep stacking them on top of each other. All right, guys. Are you kidding me? Dude, did not have to do this. Darius Slayton. Contenders Optic. Auto. And these are on car, guys. Let me just get the better angle for you. Wow. Dude. Didn't have to go and give me these autos, man. I really appreciate it. Definitely helping out the Giants PC because I just, I just don't have any... Uh, Giants autos. I did catch a Xavier McKinney from a giveaway from the card scrimp the other day. So the PC for that is growing. And guys, look at this. Touchdown, Elijah Kansas Lipscomb. City. Prism. Hold on, let me take this tape off so we can really appreciate this card. There we go. Good enough. We'll get the back later. Look at that patch. Very cool looking patch. Elijah Lipscomb. He was the undrafted rookie. And he's still with the Chiefs, guys. He's on the practice squad right now. Because we're stacked. You know, we're just stacked at receiver. So he's a young guy. He's still got a chance. Elijah Lipscomb, 22 out of 99. Dude, thank you so much. Derb, sports talking cards, guys. Go check him out. Fantastic channel. Um, he, likes to, he, he, like me, likes to do edits. He does a little bit more with the video, though. So it's always very entertaining, guys. Go check his channel out. And he gave me a kid reporter. What a guy. Don't take that guy. That's my that's my code. It's very important to me. All right, guys. This package, I'm not showing it any more than this because there's, there's addresses everywhere. I don't know why. But this is from Junior Baseball Fanatic 12. And this was a giveaway, guys, that uh, I was lucky enough to enter and win. He had a little note or something in the envelope. So let's just take this out and read it. Okay. <clears throat> Dear Sean, the card dojo, congrats on the win. Thanks for the support. Hope you pull something good. Keep me posted. Your YouTube buddy, Junior Baseball Fanatic 12. Now, guys, Junior Baseball Fanatic 12 is another one of my favorite channels to watch. He's a young dude out there ripping a lot of baseball cards. And you can hear the pure excitement in his voice that he's just having a lot of fun doing it, which is fantastic. And they do battles with the family. He gets the, the parents involved, mom, dad, and him. They all rip cards together. It's just a great thing to watch. Excuse me, so I highly encourage you guys to go over there and check out his uh, content. Now, what did we get? Guys, tops. 2020 Chrome. I have not been able to find this anywhere. And I've looked everywhere. So, dude, Junior Baseball from 912, I really appreciate the opportunity to let me get a product that I have not been able to get my hands on. So, what do we have here? We have three tops Chrome packs plus five exclusive pink refractor parallel cards so we're gonna get right into this and we're gonna show junior baseball fanatic 12 what we get out of this package let me move some of these beautiful cards that derbs gave us to the side and then after after this if not taking too long guys i have other baseball products i have not had a chance to rip open yet either um archives donruss and some stadium club i just want to rip some baseball i have not found that guy what's his name uh lewis robert robert Louis Robert, uh, Lou Bob, 
And guys, I have not opened Top Chrome. These cards look fantastic. I've been hoping to get a hold of them. And thanks to our men over at Junior Baseball Fanatic, we got them. All right, I can't pronounce names. I don't know baseball that well, but I'm learning. So we have uh, D. Gordon, Nolan, Renato, okay. Mike Trout, ooh, okay, hold on. This is a die cut, guys, look at this. Mike Trout uh, wins above replacement. Don't know what that means, 2010s. Mike Trout, very cool card. And it gives us a lot of extra corners to worry about. All right, and then look at this, an Eloy Jimenez. Now, I'm not too familiar with this guy, but uh, I know Big Mike is always talking about Eloy. So it has to be good, right? Because Big Mike knows his stuff. So Big Mike tells me to look for Eloy's, I'm looking for Eloy's. And if Big Mike, you're watching this and you want that, we can work something out. <laughs> but I think uh, Lou Bob is also on the White Sox. So we're gonna find that guy. All right, McKay. Um, Clubber. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Clubber on that. Carlos Carrera. These cards are great looking cards, guys. Victor Reyes, and this should be the um, the prism or the refractor, I guess. This is tops. I gotta learn my tops terminology. Refractor, do they call it refractors? Yeah, see, they put it right there for you. Um, Refractor. Very cool. Sliding in there. To home. Alright, we got two more packs. One of these normal packs. And then we have a, a bonus refractor pack. So let's see who we get. I'm not going to try his name. I'm going to call him Jose. We got Elvis Andreas. Or Andres. We have a... Andrelton Simmons. Very interesting names. And a Future Stars for Mitch Keller. Again, looks like another refractor. I think this is an insert refractor. Very cool. All right. Let me put him down over here next to Eli. So now we have this little extra pack of uh, pink refractor cards. And these top packs open up so nicely. I do appreciate that. I can feel like a security tag in here, I think. Yeah. Goodbye. Okay, so who do we pull? Junior Fernandez. Very cool looking pink refractors. I like it. Brian Reynolds. Justin Verlander. I've heard of him. Jose Altuve. Another name I've heard of. Which is great. And the final card. Trevor Story. I know I pulled a couple of Trevor Stories. This is a nice looking card. Got the action shot. Got the grimace. All right, Junior Sports, the Nat Baseball Fanatic. Junior Baseball Fanatic 12, thank you, dude. I really appreciate that. I finally got my hands on some Topps Chrome. So, continuing on the segue, we're gonna do Archives Baseball. So unfortunately, we didn't get the Lou Bob. Can we get him in here? I don't really know. Oops, I hit the camera, sorry guys. Don't know much about this. I didn't do much research. But we're gonna keep looking. Uh, Alan Trammell. Whitey Ford of the New York Yankees. That's a PC hit. Frank Thomas. I know him, they called him the Big Hurt, I believe. Frank Thomas, a lot of White Sox showing up. A lot of good White Sox out there. Alex Rodriguez. Back on the Rangers. Became a Yankee. Married J-Lo. Living a good life. Sean Murphy. Okay. Whit Merrifield. Uh, DJ Le... Le... Hmm. Le Mayu? Not sure. So these are like a throwback looking card. Very interesting. Shin, Shin So Chu. Zach something. Going back to the correct escaping here. We got CC Sabathia. CC yeah, in Milwaukee. Interesting. All right. John Means. Orioles. 
Um, Tom Seaver for the Mets. Tony Gwynn for the Padres. Bob Gibson for the Cardinals. Lou Brock for the Cardinals. And the final card in this pack is going to be Nick Solon. Solak. Alright guys, I'm going to speed it up. I'm taking too long as I know I'm going to do. And we're doing baseball. And this is a big, big fat pack of Donruss. So this is kind of like ludicrous speed and slap through the base. Sanchez. Renfro. Davis. Something. Olsen. Rodriguez. Turn around. Cigara. Stanton. There we go. Now, it's hard for me to recognize these sometimes even more now because we're not dealing with tops. You say Kikuchi. Crawford. Uh, as we know, uh, Panini does not have the license to use um, team logos or anything. So we're going to have to like figure out what team they are on. There's just Texas. So they're the Rangers. Raider Rookie. For Burke. Diamond Kings for uh, Buster Posey. Houston with uh, Gigante. Nick Solak. Eugene Suarez. Anthony uh, Gwynn. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Well, looks like a cool dude, huh? All right. Aaron Judge. There we go. There's a Yankee. So we'll put that over the Yankees PC. We got what looks like to be a red parallel from Mike Trout. Anthony Gwynn. Escobar. Ooh, this is a cool looking one. American Pride. Uh, Team USA. Nick Lofton. Collegiate National Team. Roger Clemens. Old school. All right. I like it. Alan Trammell. Sheldon Noose. Uh, Eddie Murray. And Logan Allen. Guys, let's speed this up. I'm taking too long. What else is new? What else is new? You guys know. Uh, Stadium Club, the last baseball product that I will be looking at today. And I've seen a little bit of this being ripped. Uh, in fact, I watched uh, Junior Baseball Fanatic 12 rip his hobby box. And guys, go watch that because he pulled some crazy cards. But what I really appreciate about this product, which I want to find more of because I can't get it anywhere, um, is the photography on this. I think this must be a red parallel, which is why it was upside down. But look at the photography on the, in this product, guys. It's fantastic. Right here, we had a, uh, a Rod Carew. Definitely old school. You can tell by the hairdo. All right, one last little pack, guys. And then I have one little tidbit of news to give you. And then I'll let you go for the weekend. And I hope you have a great one. All right, we got Steven Strasburg. There we go. Uh, Chapman to the Yankees. A little underhand. Underhand toss. No more. That guy. Alright, we got Justin Verlander. And this is going to be a shot from the blimp. Look at that cool angle. Fantastic. Why was this one backwards and upside down? I don't know. I don't know what's special about it. Other than the fact that it's just a cool looking card. Okay, and the last card of today's rip, guys, will be Matt Olson. Alright, right on to news, guys. And the news of the day is the Chiefs played against the Texans on Thursday. I haven't talked about it yet, but I do have to talk about it. Why? This is that man right there. You know I've been hyping him up. You know I've been talking about him. How about 25 attempts for 138 yards, a touchdown. Uh, he had two targets, but he did not haul in a catch, unfortunately which is actually one of the best aspects of his game, is he, he's a great pass catcher. And uh, he had a bunch of goal line opportunities. He probably could have had three touchdowns. He just got stuffed. So that's something to work on. Remember, no preseason. First time touching the NFL football in a game, and he went off. So guys, now you probably see why I've been so hyped on him, and now you know why I was so angry that he was not in Legacy. So, guys, I'm showing highlights. Look at all those spin moves. Look at the power. I'm excited for Clyde Edwards Alaire. His uh, card prices were high, and now they've skyrocketed all the way to the moon. And uh, yeah, I can't afford those cards anymore. As usual, I can't afford you know, Pat Mahomes, and now I can't afford Clyde. But I got this one, so at least I'm not completely out. Um, guys, I did mention that I was going to try to do the giveaway this week, but unfortunately I just can't because 
I want to give everyone a week to get in on commenting on the video. And basically what happens is next Saturday, which is when I would be ripping it, I have a previous engagement. I need to be out of town. So it's just not going to be a good day. So what I'm going to do is next Saturday, I will make a video that you can comment on. And then the Saturday afterwards will be the live stream if I can figure it out. So guys, I'm sorry that I can't do it for you this weekend. I'm just not going to be around next week to actually do the rip. And I want to do it comfortably. I don't want to be rushing around, trying to drive home, making sure I get here on time. I want to be able to relax, enjoy the Saturday, and then uh, be able to sit down with you guys. And on that note, would you prefer me to do the live rip on a Saturday or on a Sunday, like maybe after the PM games? What's better for you guys? Because I'm still trying to plan this out right. I want to make sure that people can show up. We're going to be ripping that legacy box, and I'm going to have giveaways of packs and single cards to people who show up in the live stream. Assuming I can do it live, I got to figure that out with YouTube. So guys, I went way too long as always. We're in at 21 minutes. So I apologize for that, but I appreciate you sticking by. And as always, thank you for stopping by. Take care.